Matthew 15 says this in verses 30 through 31. And great multitudes came unto him. Listen, there was something that was happening in the environment that was causing the people to respond. They heard something. They saw something. And so multitudes came to him to receive something of him. On that night when those deaf ears were opened out there in Central Asia in that cold, smelly, hard to breathe tent. On that night when those ears opened, there was a noise that spread abroad across that city and people came because they understood that the God of this holy book, he was not a God of history, but the God of this holy book who showed that he would heal in history was a God who is still alive and continuing to heal today and throughout all history. Now, this is the beginning of our series that I am calling Healing Throughout History. Today, we have established the precedence that it is obvious that the many contextual scriptures throughout the Old Covenant prove to us that it is God's will to heal. And the reality of Jesus and his earthly ministry were a confirmation to us that it is God's will in this new covenant to heal today.